yo, shout out to Black Diamond. Yo, what is up, guys? Wing Life here, coming at you with episode 4 Best League Play Class Fs. Now, if I sound a little stuffy, I'm actually just getting over a cold right now, but I wanted to do this commentary. Now, I'm gonna actually hurry up and try to finish up this series. Uh, I just started a new series called Road to Masters. Basically, if you haven't seen that, link down in the description below. It's basically where I try to get to Masters. I'm gonna be uploading that quite a bit. Also, with this new series, I will be having coming out the next day, probably after I upload this, or a couple days. But anyways, guys, best league play class setup, so let's get right into it. Now, this is going to be more of a class for anchoring and playing back, and just overall trying to protect your flag and CTF. Now, the class I'm using is the AN-94 with extended mags and stock. Now, I like stock on all my ARs, so I always use an AR on my AN-94 or on any assault rifle. Now I use extend mag because you always need those extra bullets to get the job done. Now I know I pick up an MSMC during this game, but I could have easily just used the A94 to pick them off well. I also use a cap 40 for secondary so I can pull out and I do get a couple key, key kills in this game to help me get the flag and keep an anchor spot. Now I use flak jacket mainly so I don't get hit by explosives. I use fast hand so I can hurry up and throw down my trophy systems and throw grenades at people. And I use tactical mask in case I get thrown at and I have no more trophy systems, so it doesn't really do much damage to me. Now that's mainly what I like to use, and at the end of this clip, you guys will actually see a pretty sick setup. I get my sentry gun and my dragon flyer now. Let me let you know why I'm using this. RCXD I like to use it because if our flag does get pulled, and I can hurry up and pop that out and drive to where our flag is at and hopefully blow him up in time. Now I also like to use the fly thing, the dragon fly I believe it's called. Because I can over easily just hover over our flag and easily just protect it just as well as me sitting there. And it's actually a better way of that because I can go high up in the sky or on top of the building or something like that and just cover it. And overall... It's really great to use for CTF that I found out. Now, at the end of this clip, you guys will actually see a pretty sick setup, like I was saying. I get my sentry gun and dragon fire, and we get two sentry guns set up right next to each other. And I'm laying down right in between it, and I have my two trophy systems underneath the sentry guns. And I have my there's a guy sitting right uh, crouched down or standing up right behind me. So he's in between the two sentry guns behind me. And I got my dragon fire up above, and it just looks like a really sick clip. And I actually took a picture and put it in the top right corner. So once it gets to the end, uh, check that out. It's really cool, and it looks funny. Uh, I hope you guys enjoy the rest of this video, and I hope these tips are helping you. I'm going to hurry up and try to finish up this series since I did start Road to Masters. Hope you guys have a great day. Peace. Chill with honeys, all I do is shine. Show the world ain't it funny, I'm one of a kind.